You can see the part now that has come off the machine has bare material showing where there was no support needed and then you can also see the support on the inside where it was needed. Also on the bottom you'll see the gel like material that comes right off with your fingers but we're also going to run this through a water jet to clean it completely. Okay so we have our part done here. Now you can see that the part still has all of the support material still inside of it. We have a lot of support material inside these little cracks and grooves and we have the support material that was also on the bottom that kept the uh, part down on the tray. Now most of this material can just be peeled away or pressed away just by your fingers. But all that support material on the inside of the gears has to be washed out and the best way to do that is with one of these. So this is the wash unit. So here we have our water jet on the inside here. We have our part. What I'm going to do is just going to lay this in here for now just so we can get in there. I'm going to close the lid. Snap these down here. Okay. Now all I need to do is just fit my hands in the gloves. I'm going to turn the valve the water starts flowing. And I've got a foot gear so I can actually start the, the flow of the high pressure. Now you can see here I can hold the part in my hand at the high pressure water. And now I can just start blowing off the part. Start getting all that material out of there. see we have our part here all nice and clean. You can see that this is a moving gear. This was printed this way, one solid piece. This is one of the wonderful things you can do with polyjet technology and 3D printing is that you can build parts that you can normally never assemble if they were printed separately. So this is printing just as is on one piece. Please reach us at the number or email below for any more information. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you again.